Welcome back to another back office video from Modi's Soft. My name is Nancy and today we're going to go over how to update your billing. Once you sign in and select your store, you're going to go to the top right corner where the three bars are at. Once you select it, more icons will appear. There you will see a billing icon. After selecting the icon it will take you to this page. Here you will see relevant information regarding your billing, like the billing start date or the next billing date, along with the price of the back office and any other services you have with Modi's Soft and the total that will be billed for the upcoming month. Under the billing information, we offer two ways to pay. A CH which stands for Automated Clearinghouse, which is a network that moves funds electronically from bank to bank. Secondly, which most people are most familiar with, is paying by credit card. For the purpose of this demonstration, I will go over how to add your CH and credit card information to the billing. For a CH, the first thing that is required is your account number which typically consists of 8 to 12 digits, but some account numbers could even contain up to 17 digits. Then you will re-enter the account number. Next, you will enter the routing number. Then you will re-enter the routing number. After that, you will enter the bank name. Since you are paying by a CH then you are required to upload a void check that matches the information you provided above. Then you will also enter your billing email, phone, address, city, zip code, and state. Once that is complete. Make sure to select the checkbox below, agreeing to the terms of use, and hit submit. A pop-up will appear stating that your billing has been successfully updated. Now I will go over how to enter the credit card information. The first thing that is required is your credit card number which is typically 16 digits which can be found in the front or back of your card. Then you will re-enter the credit card number. The next thing you will put is the CVV number that is in the back of the card. This number is three digits. Once that is done, you will put the expiration month and year, like this. Then you will also enter your billing email, phone, address, city, zip code, and state. Once that is complete, make sure to select the checkbox below, agreeing to the terms of use, and hit submit. A pop-up will appear stating that your billing has been successfully updated. We hope that you found this guide useful in better understanding your Modi's soft back office. Please like, subscribe, and click on the notification bell so that you will always be up to date on your Modi's soft back office. Thank you, and have a wonderful day.